from the Art and Villa Mine, Messina, South Africa. I'm very pleased to be able to do the video on this piece. I think this may very well be a floater. Please have a, a final look in my description on the eBay listing. Of course, all these videos correspond with eBay listings. So now we have the top crown, which is a multitude of milky to clear quartz crystals forming the... I just want to see, it's a little bit underexposed as we're seeing it now. Let me see if I can get the exposed. Now it's a bit overexposed. Ah, there we go, getting a bit better. So going right around there, that would be the main termination of this crystal. Let's have a look at the crystallization. So I think here, let's go with the reflections to give you an idea of the crystallization. Running right across the top there, go across the sides, uh, more typical quartz crystal sitting up there. Crystallization happening here as well. And now let's have a look for color. Of course, we always look for the Ajoite and the Papagawite. I don't see any in this piece. Actually, uh, if I if I see any, I'll mention it in my skill description in my description. But note that I am a bit color challenged, and I usually ask my wife for for her color inputs. Um, and and I often often we both so busy I don't get a chance to ask. So I just let it go as hematite included quartz all the way from Art and Villa Mine, Messina, South Africa. Lovely form on this top termination. I think crystallographically, even esoterically, there's, there must be a word for this. It's one crystal with uh, uh, quite a few, I won't say hundreds, but a multitude, maybe in excess of 10 terminations running from the one crystal.